we've been on and off again and again I don't know which way we're going, no control You push me, then you pull me back in Don't know if I can decipher how your mind works Yeah, you leave me wondering what it's like to feel your skin I will keep on trying till You give me a sign Give me a sign Hello lovelies and welcome back to the channel. Today's video is jam-packed with cleaning motivation. If we go any further, I want to wish you guys a happy new year. In today's video, I have plenty of laundry to fold. I'm doing a quick pickup in my bedroom and also some vacuuming. If you are new here, my name is Rogina. I am a full-time working boy mom and I love posting cleaning and lifestyle content right here on YouTube. If you are enjoying the content, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. I am starting by clearing off this dresser and wiping it down. So I hope you guys had an amazing holiday. I know it was kind of different because y'all miss Rona when I leave us alone, but I am praying that everybody enjoyed it and stayed safe. I could go for this, no more tricks. As you can see, I have all my little elf pajamas. We had just taken our uh, family Christmas photos. I have added chapters to this video so you can skip around because such a large chunk of it is laundry. So if you want a little bit of laundry motivation and then you want to skip on to the next part, you can. No control, you push me, then you pull me back in. We've been on and off again and again. I don't know which way we're going, no control. You push me, then you pull me back in. Now on to folding the laundry. I had so much laundry to fold because it was getting closer to Christmas. This is like the week before Christmas. And of course, I was still shopping. I do this every freaking year. I wait till the last minute to order, to shop. It was just... I don't know why I do this to myself, but I was so busy right before Christmas. And also I was taking like the week um, of after Christmas off. So I was really busy at work. So I just did not have time to stay on top of my laundry. So I was off work from December 24th to January 4th. And oh y'all it was such a struggle to go back to work oh my gosh i hadn't been off that long in a very long time and it was a struggle
The laundry is all folded. I'm going to go ahead and dust this fan. I love this duster. It has an extension pole. You can bend it and angle it and the dust sticks to the duster. I love it.
As you can see, I still had more laundry to fold, but you already know I did not fold all of that. I, my limit is like three loads, <laughs> and after that, I'm burnt out and done. Christian had already cleaned his room, so I wanted to just go in and vacuum it. He actually does a really good job at cleaning his room. Don't get me wrong, he is not voluntarily going in there and just cleaning it. <laughs> but if I say, hey, you need to clean this room, um, he does a really good job. And now I'm just going in and vacuuming Caleb's room in those bags on the wall were two bags of kids clothes that I had to get rid of. Everything was just too small. And luckily I found a family that I could give them to. Um, so I didn't have to like just give them to Goodwill. I prefer to give them to somebody that I know is going to use them. So I usually either donate them to NAMI, which is a mental health um non-profit or I try to give them to like an actual family in need come run away don't be afraid And now I'm just gonna go ahead and vacuum my room while my kids are going to And that is it, you guys. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in the next video. The first step is always hard when you walk out of the doorway, but that's just the place to start.